Hi guys, how are you? My name is Felix and I come from Venezuela. Hi guys, my name is Cine, I come from Colombia. And we have already four years studying in our beautiful university. Woohoo! <laughs> Zhejiang University of Science and Technology. Today, guys, we're going to introduce our student life here in Hanzhou. Woohoo! Come on with us! So right now we're using our very convenient app called Alipay. In Alipay you can find Didi here and with this app you can very conveniently call a taxi. Alright guys, so we're here calling a taxi and we are now going to Uling Square. Let's see from here, okay 58 yuan, let's call the taxi. Hey, waiting for the taxi. We got a taxi. Nice. Three minutes from here. Automatically, we're here in Uli Square. Because we're going to the subway, we need to carry our mask. Now, if you got a smartwatch, it's much more convenient because you don't need to even take out your phone. You can find the application here, and I have here my code. So, why we come to Ulin Square? Well, Ulin Square is very, like, very much the center of Hangzhou. From here, you can move to many different places, and it's very convenient, Ulin Square. So now we're going to visit other places, going to Fenchilu. You can see the time from the train. So the first train is already here. The next one will be here in three minutes and the next, next one will be in six minutes. Very convenient also. Very quiet, very nice, very clean, modern. We like the subway in China, it's very beautiful. Yeah, it's so quick, like you can go everywhere, you don't need to spend so much time, you don't need to like, uh, have some traffic, so it's yeah. to And it's very safe also, at any time of the day. And also it starts for like from 5 a.m. until 11.30, something like that. Yeah. Again, the same code, and that is all. Oh, okay. After you go out, the Alipay application already charged these two yuan automatically from your bank account. So it's very convenient. Everything is linked together, so you don't need to carry your wallet, yeah. cash. You don't need to just carry your phone or even your, your watch. Even you don't need to put any password or anything. Everything is automatic. Yeah. Subway, I think it's so convenient because from inside you also have a lot of stores. You can buy a lot of clothes, shoes, everything. So also even clothes you can buy it inside the subway. So if you are hungry, clothes so can get something. So what happens if you uh, you don't have battery? You're out outside and you don't have battery. There's no problem in China. You can find. 
these boxes. They have a lot of power banks here. And you just need your phone, scan the code here. It's very convenient and you can rent your own uh, power bank. And they are so cheap, you only have to pay like five quads, like for defense. For I think power, it's like three, or... three yeah, or something. But it's super convenient and you can have power. You can do many things with the phone in China. In China, if you want to go out, you only have to take your cell phone and add it somewhere. Yeah. Now we are going to the other center. It's one of the, I think one of the most popular commercials here in China. It's so beautiful, it's so huge, I really like it. You can find a lot of stores and buy everything that you want. Nice restaurants yeah. and uh, right now because we are in the new year uh, they have beautiful decorations so yeah it's a recommended place here in the job. Right now they have these cameras here they take your temperature that's my temperature over there find a supermarket so if you want to go and buy some groceries or anything buy it here here you can do everything like for example if you go out to work or a store you can be here buy your own food you can go shopping you can do everything here we're going to a nice place <laughs> get some lunch I think also foreigners like the Kerry Center because even if, for example, you don't want to eat Chinese food, you have different options or many foreign restaurants, international restaurants, like Blue Frog, pizza, places, barbecue, anything. So here in China it's very convenient right now in, because in most of the restaurants you have the QR code in every table so with your phone you scan the code and you can order by your, yourself. And it's so quickly and easy because you don't need, you don't need to, to, the, to go to the Fuyuan or anything, you just have to scan the code and order anything that you want. Guys, the food is here. I ordered right. one uh, Hawaiian pizza, delicious. It's my best pizza, my favorite pizza here in China. And order this pasta. It has delicious shredded meat. Very nice. So let's start to eat. So this place in the night is so beautiful because they have a lot of lights in everywhere. Here you have like a square. Oh, it's so beautiful. So if you want to go out and see a beautiful places with a lot of lights this is a good option for you so this street is called Yang An Street this is like the main street of Hangzhou commercially talking it has shops, a lot of activity a lot of international and also Chinese stores here, if you want to buy something, you can find anything. Anything that you want, you can find it over here. I really like to come to this place because they have a lot of options and also they work like every day and like until late. Just renting a bike with my phone. And check out all the delicious food available in Hangzhou. This is all like Chinese food, but it's other delicious. In this area of Yenan Street, you can find a lot of different international uh, places. For example, Victoria's Secret, Armani, a lot of international brands. Chanel. They have a 
lot of places here also. It's like one of the most biggest uh, Apple store in China, in China and Joe. Yeah. So you can find it here. And also, front of all, you can find the West Lake. So this is a convenient area because you have like a lot of landscape and also you have stores. You can see here's a lot of people. It's a very nice contrast between the natural places, which is the West Lake and all the other high buildings, the commercial street. Like a traditional one. We are in the Hefa Street. Woohoo! Welcome guys to Hefa Street. This is one of the actually oldest streets in Hanzhou. Very nice, very traditional style. So let's enjoy. different shops, uh, you can try different types of tea, buy handcrafts, many things. This is the Copper Museum in the Heffern Street. It's very beautiful. You can see many different uh, objects made with copper. she was looking for so we will go to a dozen more shops until we return to the first one and she buys the original piece Thank you guys for checking out this video and I hope you like it and see you next time. Bye bye!